My name is Saad Antiri. I am from Al Qasim University in Saudi Arabia. I am studying at Newcastle University for my PhD in Applied Linguistics. The goal of my PhD research was to develop a model that can facilitate the analysis of second language task-based interaction. I used a combination of methods and technologies so that the model can enable a holistic analysis of second language task-based interaction. This proposed model includes various elements, such as task-based language teaching, multimodality, conversation analysis, and the tabletop technology. I am trying to show how the model can enable a holistic analysis of task-based interaction. Tabletops are horizontal multi-user digital displays that allow multiple concurrent inputs from participants. A digital tabletop can accept input from three participants using stylus pens simultaneously. The table can sense which pen is doing what at any given point in time. It keeps track of how the participants are manipulating and completing the task. What makes this technology distinct from other forms is its capability to accommodate pairs or groups of students interacting and collaborating using one technological tool simultaneously. This multi-user orientation that the tabletop allows is a big advantage in many ways. First, it goes in parallel with the need for language learners to communicate and use the target language as is the case in TBLT. It also provides a much needed tool for studying task-based interaction in depth. The main problem that this research tries to solve is the analysis of task-based interaction. Students' interaction in tasks is very fluid and dynamic. Previous research seems to fail to capture in fine detail the intricacies and multimodal nature of task-based interaction. This is one reason why a holistic model is needed to portray the details of what happens in language classrooms. In this research, I tried to apply the model to data collected from a digital tabletop environment. Analysis of the data shows how participants synchronize verbal and nonverbal resources using precise timing to accomplish the task. The analysis also shows how multimodal analysis can reveal the mutual interplay between verbal and nonverbal resources and how these resources are used to organize action. Analyzing the data using the model also shows that participants develop unique speech exchange systems that involve a lot of nonverbal communication to accomplish the task in the tabletop environment. The technology used in this research represents a powerful tool in the educational arena. As shown in the analysis of the data of this study, it is clear that we can now have access to the details of TPI, task-based interaction, while it is taking place. This facility can be used to inform our planning and design of teaching materials in the future. More emphasis should be placed on the role of nonverbal communication in the task-based language teaching classroom. This study showed that participants rely on the contribution of nonverbal resources to accomplish the ongoing task. The model relies on the tabletop technology to capture the details of task-based interaction. The technology might fit nicely in an interactive classroom and could enhance the quality and depth of interaction. Interaction as used here includes the embodied interaction, which plays an immense role in human communication, but is often neglected in the studies of language education. This type of technology is capable of paving the way for a better understanding of the intricacies of task-based interaction, and it could also potentially yield insights on how to approach task-based interaction over extended periods of time to obtain a longitudinal perspective. This study contributes to an emerging line of research which explores the interplay between interaction, multimodality, and technology in the language classroom. 
This model is a promising tool that could potentially allow researchers to unravel how learning precisely happens in language task-based classrooms.